Consumer alert. Right now, gas prices are reaching the highest they've been all year, according to AAA. You can see sprawling lines at a gas station in San Antonio. AAA says with oil refineries and pipelines shutting down because of Harvey, there's a higher demand for gasoline. Channel 4's Corley Peel shows us what kind of prices you can expect this Labor Day weekend and when they'll go down. Clint Jacobs says he noticed the cost to fill up his tank was more expensive than usual while driving from Georgia to Florida on Thursday. It takes a little over $20, so I'm expecting now it's going to be closer to $30. Triple A says that's because heavy rainfall from Harvey forced oil refineries to shut down, causing gas prices to go up. Gas prices could go up 5 to 15 cents going into Labor Day weekend, according to Triple A, which is the highest we've seen this year. Don't like it, but. Uh, it's one of those unfortunate necessities. According to AAA, the average gas prices here in Florida went up five cents overnight, from roughly two dollars and thirty-five cents on Wednesday to two dollars and forty cents on Thursday. But gas prices in Jacksonville rose nine cents to two dollars and forty-nine cents. I saw like every station had a two forty-nine. So I didn't even bother to to find a cheaper gas. Probably ride the motorcycle a little more. AAA says gas prices aren't expected to go down until mid-September. Jacob says until then, he'll be making less trips across state lines. Now, AAA says gas stations in the most convenient locations tend to have the higher gas prices. They say you can find gas 20 to 30 cents cheaper if you go out of the way. Reporting in Jacksonville, Corley Peel, Channel 4, The Local Station.